You'd be very surprised, but you can predict future market tops and bottoms like this one here on the chart. Or you'd be surprised uh, knowing only that you can forecast these tops and bottoms over here, as you see on this chart. Or eventually, you also can predict these tops and bottoms, as you see right here. You can predict them based on universal clock ticking with the law of vibration and you would be able to predict most reversals knowing the starting point value only. Hello, bonjour, guten tag and mahaba. Namaste, salamat pagi and buenas dias, good day to your trader. This is Mario Forex, other way. In today's video I'm going to show you that you can easily predict these extremes of the swings as you see on the chart without any problem. If you stay with me to the end of this video your trading will never be the same again. So let's start the rock and roll. One of the most precise methods of forecasting future highs and lows of the instrument you trade is the law of vibration. A part of this law was used by WD Gunn Square of 9 and this method I teach on my private tutorial sessions via Skype. You don't have to but if you want to learn more about it send me an email for details. This amazing forecast I will show you later on in this video. What I wanted to share with you today is an amazing universal clock which ticks above us and gives us amazing trading signals, if you know how to read them, obviously. The clock is our moon, the moon seen on the sky every evening when the weather is fine and we've got clear skies. And when we spot the right extreme of the market, we are done, my friend. We know that the moon, the full moon, appears on the sky every 29 and a half days and we call it synodic period of the moon. By definition, synodic period is the time required for a body within the solar system such as a planet, the moon or an artificial Earth satellite to return to the same or approximately the same position relative to the sun as seen by an observer on the Earth. So synodic period is what we see and the synodic period of the Moon is 29 and a half days. But there is also another period called sidereal period, which is the time required for a celestial body within the solar system to complete one revolution with respect to the fixed stars. There is as observed from some fixed point outside the system. So this is slightly different. So when we observe the moon, it's making a full cycle around the Earth in 27.3 days, a little bit faster than we see from the Earth. So based on this, we can make a calculation, 27.3, I have a very simple calculation here, a period of the moon, and multiplied it by half of the period, full period, one and a half, and so on, and I added it to my magic number, which is 1st of September 2020, when Euro USD made a high, that was important high, and look what happened after half of the period. Half of the period, half of 27.3 is 1365. And if you add this number of days to the starting point, we get 14th of September. When we add the full cycle, we got 28th of September. We got one and a half period, which is nearly 41 days. We got 11 of October and so on and I've got everything marked up to here. So as of today, we are on 27th February 2021, and this is Saturday 11.15 UTC plus one. 
So let me show you what happened here. We got 14 and 28 of September. I marked these dates in advance. So we got 14 and 28. Look, bam, one top, one bottom. Next one, we got 11 and 25th October. Look over here, we got 11, one top, and 25th. Oh, it's 26. Sorry, 11 is 12. Wrong? Not. Because here is 9th and it's Friday. And it's 12th of October, which is Monday. 11 was on Sunday. So if we got the date which is falling on Sunday, usually we, we move the marking point on Monday. And uh, the same like here, we got 26th, 23rd. And 25th, as you remember, was on Sunday. So I marked the next trading day. The nearest trading day was Monday. And this is 26th of October. We got 8th and 21st of November. Look over here. This is the 8th again. We got 9 marked. Here is uh, 6, which was Friday. 8 was Sunday. So 9th, of, 9th 11 was the time when the marked market reversed again so we got december 5th and 19th let's check it this is fifth which is a local top before this small correction it today's correction started at the date uh, what is uh, once again sorry this is 20th of uh, november 20th instead of 19th because 19th was Sunday again look here is uh, here is the date of 19 oh sorry 19 sorry sorry about that that's 19 was it 19 yes it was was it 19 no my friend this is November November we got here November was uh, 20 first of november so 21st we got 20th and this one is 23rd so 21st was saturday that's the reason why we marked 20th okay next one 4th of december the same story we got 5th of december marked here and here we got 4th and here this is the mm, 7th and here we got 4th so 5th was on Saturday 18th December I marked here and we got 19th so again the same story because uh, this is 18th and this is already 21st so 18 was Friday Saturday was 19 was this reversal point and 1st of January is a day off usually, so it's marked as 31st of December. Over here, we got three more to go. 15 and 29th January. My friend, this is 15th of January and 29th of January. We got this candle. Last but not least, 11 February and 25th of February. So we got 11th of February, this top, very close. And 25th of February, recently we got on Thursday. We are Saturday, I'm reminding you, 27th, 02, 2021. And 25th marked based on the top from the 1st September 2020. We could hit it right to the day in most cases it's not bad it's working really fine well you might have seen uh, some videos of a uh, legend of guns videos on uh, youtube mr michael jenkins he's a legend he really is and his method i just present something like this that you got that date you got the value 1.20 we had 120.11 that was uh, i think it was high on 1st of september let me check it 120.11 so it's high 120.11 yes it is the very high of the market and 120 projected in this way 
1.2 as a, a matter of 1.2 of the week is 8.4 days which falls on 9 september look my friend 9 september so we got first off here is 9 september the next line which is projected here 1.2 of the month is 36.57 days if added to this date will give us 7 of october and 7 of october is just a local bottom here and another one 12 weeks multiplied by 12 this time we move the decimal point after 12 weeks from that top 84 days we got 24th of november and 24th of november is just the beginning after the correction of this upswing to to the end of 2020 and last but not least what we've got over here i just doubled this value i multiply them by two so we got 16.8 days from this date is 17 of september which falls over here this is 17 of september very harmonic point multiplied by two a 1.2 month so it's 2.4 month again harmonic value 73 days 13 november which is right here in the middle of nowhere but it's also very close to the beginning of this upswing and over here we doubled 84 12 weeks so 24 weeks from this top is 1602 2021 1602 2021 it has been reaction of the market now the most important the nicest one i think as i told you at the beginning of this video the most precise method of uh, forecasting future tops or bottoms is the method based on wd guns square of nine and uh, more precisely based on the code of the law of vibration hidden behind the square of nine on this excel sheet i've got the dates calculated on the principle of the using the harmony of the cycles and to say more, more precisely it is calculated by using this triangle this cycle uh, how to say that uh, it's uh, calculated based on the cycle on the price from this this point 23rd of june very important point very important reversal there is a cycle which ended up over here and it's calculated one third of the cycle is 120 two thirds is 240 degree 360 is uh, is right over here over here and uh, here i've got some dates added up and it's really amazing i just checked up i had a session with someone yesterday one of my students a uh, very nice fella and we went through it i didn't realize that yesterday was 26. i didn't realize again it was a hit so i marked it yesterday on 26th of february 2020 this is 11 out of 12 so it's not bad it's just from first it's from uh, calculated from 23rd of june 2020 which was a very important reversal point from my point of view and in this way all the stops and bottoms whatever they are they've been calculated and all of them are hits some of them are small reversals some of them are the bigger ones let me show you so here's no it's not the starting point the starting point is here this one this is a candle it, that, it's not the top but it's very harmonic i tell you why this is very harmonic 23rd of june 2020 because exactly 365 days before was another local top let's call it local top uh, on june 24th over here 2019 and this is exactly 365 days later happened why this is harmonic because it's very harmonic it's just uh, harmonic to 
to 1.6038, which was all time high on your USD, very harmonic point. And uh, 365 days later appeared this one, and this is the base to calculate what I've shown you here, all these dates, which only 29th of December was missing, and all the rest of them, look how they how they fallen exactly over here. So I got first four is 14, 9, 25, 9, 9, 10, and 23, 10. They are here, first 9, 13, 9, 25th, and 9th because it's different in days, because again, it was a Saturday on, or Sunday over here somewhere. But trust me, it works. This is the next one, 9, 11, 11 9 of September, 20, November, 21st of November, is just a end of local correction. Further here is just a local correction. This one is a complete miss, is in the middle of nowhere. But look here, uh, 2021 January 18 we got it here January 17 because uh, uh, seven, uh, 17 was on Sunday because we got 15 here and we got 18 here here's 18 and here's 15 this one this longer candle so we got 18 oh, 18 January next one 5th February because the fallen the date has been calculated on 6th of February, which was on Saturday, actually. So the turning point was on Friday. And last but not least is just this uh, next one, this long marabuzo, which happened on 26th of February. And we've got this date here. And don't forget, it has been calculated in advance already based on this date and one date from the past and it was a range which was calculated and projected into the future in this way that we got this uh, funny points over here the next one 20th of march i think it will be a killer it's just the beginning of the season usually in the area you remember what happened last year between 19 and 23rd of uh, of March 19 was Friday, I think, and to, or Thursday 20th was Friday, and 23rd was on Monday. Just the market reversed, made a bottom, a rock bottom, and started its rally from on EURUSD was 1.06 uh, and uh, 40. So now we are at 121.50 or 121.00 whatever the value 12073 at the moment so all this rally happened starting 19th of march 20th of march 23rd of march over here the market bottomed so here 20th of march again we are very close to the date and i'm sure it will be another point of reaction of the market over here as I told you at the beginning, you don't have to, but if you want to learn more about WD Gun's secret code hidden behind the squirt of nine, send me an email for details. You'll find my email address down below this video. Thanks for watching, Green Peeps, and I'll see you the next time. Bye bye.